Today we're looking at possibly one of my favorite subreddits, r slash am I the main character. God, it's peak cringe. I love it. I have a problem with gender neutral bathrooms. There, I said it. Most of the time when I go into a gender neutral bathroom, somebody has just taken a big stinky dump. At some point, cisgendered people figured out that they now had a nice private bathroom where they could go and take all of their dumps. It's gross. Use your own bathrooms. So wait, she's angry because people use a toilet for what people are meant to use a toilet for? What am I not understanding here? Do gender neutral people just not take a massive dump every now and again? Get this absolute donut in the bin. I love watching these interview videos sometimes because honestly, it just seems like everyone in it is just like an NPC who just crawled out of the sewer. It just makes you a donut asshole. Me? Yeah, you. What are they even trying to like that? prove here? What do you mean? Why does it make me that for not kissing you? Because anyone here would. Really? Yeah, I bet. No. Watch this. All right, okay, wait, seriously, on. what okay, is... Wait, wait, wait. Is she trying to prove that she can get Watch anyone this. to kiss her? <laughs> oh my god, just totally just destroyed. Get in the bin. Stopping the highway for a music video. This is how you know a music video is going to be certified ass is because they stopped traffic to like achieve a music video. Let's see what it is. Stopping the highway for a music video. Just casually starting fights with people who are in a car. Go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. No, play We stop it. We stop it. We out. We out. We outside. No, come here, come here, come here. Don't run at me. Don't run at me. Don't run. Don't run. Don't run. Don't run at me. Where's this even going? What is the music for this? <laughs> wow, that was a great video. I remember my first beer. Making a scene on Spirit Airline. Why is that always a problem? on airplanes. I'm not being funny, you could generally just look at someone sometimes and be like, there's a flight risk, but let's see, let's see what the problem is. That's fine. I've been there before. I'm not scared. I've fucking been there before. This kid is hurting my elbow. He's hurting my wrist. Why does this sound like every six-year-old taking a bath? Honestly, I don't even know how these people even get onto planes. Just put them in the bin. Get rid. Whenever I go on a date in 2024, I don't do 50-50. Wow, how honorable, guys. She's gonna pay for the whole meal. Find me a girl like that. No, I'm joking. Fuck off. Girl dances in front of the entire class, claims the entire class hates her for no reason. Oh, God, I'm gonna love this. Oh, boy, you love to see it. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's a pretty big stretch to say that this is a school. She looks about 45 years of age and is on her third divorce. And this girl's face down here in the bottom left, I can honestly like believe she straight up hates this girl. She doesn't even look real. Like <laughs> I shouldn't I shouldn't laugh at this one, but a TikTok superstar from Texas has died while doing a TikTok dance on top of an 18 wheeler. <laughs> What, what's a TikTok superstar? <laughs> and why is he dancing on top of a truck? Like, honestly, natural selection back in the day was, you know, pretty natural. Like, you die from, like, eating contaminated food or falling off a cliff. Yet now natural selection is picking off people who decide to get on top of a truck, a moving truck, and do a TikTok dance. <laughs> why? I don't know what tower this is. Like, how? <laughs> like, you've got to admire the kudos for people to actually dance like that in public because honestly, have you guys ever seen anyone make a TikTok in public and they're dancing? It's actually like a bit of a spectacle now. You generally stop what you're doing and you look over and you're like, I admire the confidence, but goddamn, can you stop doing that? Three women go crazy and freak out because their flight got delayed. I mean, surely they didn't freak out too bad. 
what is even going on here? She just threw it. Just throwing shoes as you do. Absolute degenerate behaviour. I'm just gonna stop the video for a second. Like, what do they honestly want these flight air staff to do? Like, call up the pilot and be like, yo, you gotta speed up the, the takeoff of this plane. You gotta put it in Mac 2, my guy. This woman just threw a crusty flip flop at me. It's <laughs> like, you gotta get that plane in the air. Like, they're just attacking the staff. Oh, I've seen enough of that video. Honestly, that is just like such degenerate behavior. Like, what do they want them to do? Like, planes get delayed all the time. Like, honestly, they have such main character syndrome, they'd honestly suggest that they fly the plane themselves. These gender reveal parties are getting crazy. Oh man, I actually love these ones because they're normally just, they're just the best. <laughs> like, what is going on? This is meant to be a gender reveal party. But I'm just watching a pregnant woman just twerk. <laughs> like, what's the gender? Like, what is the gender actually meant to be here? It's meant to be a gender reveal party, but there's just no gender being shown. <laughs> the secondhand embarrassment. Oh my, the fact... <laughs> I mean, that's like really bad to see the fact she literally recoiled in pain because she was like twerking with like a baby inside of it. I remember when like gender reveal parties were like just eating some cookies and like a muffin. I don't know. I don't know what the hell I just watched. We made the flight in Dallas, but not sitting together. Guy next to me would not change seats. I hope I don't have to get up too often and bother him. In the politest way, I can probably say this. You guys look really scary. You look like set extras from the film franchise, The Wrong Turn. And if I'm being honest, how did you manage to not book a seat next to each other? Like, it's not hard. You're booking a plane. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> when, what are you going to do to get up and bother him? You're going to, like, just fart on him or something. This video is just called TikToker Attempts Carjacking Prank and gets a gun pulled out on him. Let's, let's see how good this goes. I don't think I can even put this in the video. Let's see how it goes. Though. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> All right, okay, I probably can't show you the video, but you, you got the idea of where that video is going. Word of advice, guys, if you're ever going to pull a prank on someone, maybe don't pull a prank on someone who has a skull on his t-shirt. Just a word of advice. Just might save your life one day. Woman leaves her phone on the ground to record herself picking up her friend and it gets knocked over. Oh my god, the absolute horror. I'm so sorry you had to go through that. All right, let's just check it out then. <laughs> I don't know why I just always find like little dances like that. So cringe. Maybe I'm just bitter. <laughs> I just want to point out that the fact that she set the camera up here and she ran so far into the distance this would just be the worst video ever. Like, <laughs> like come on. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> she <laughs> she's acting as if she's just like, you know, hit her dog. She's just ran over a dog. She just ran over a phone and probably stopped someone from making a genuinely bad video. Everyone hates her for being too pretty. I get shamed by other mothers for being naturally pretty with a good figure. They're just jealous because I don't need lip filler to look nice. What is that pose? Honestly, what even is that pose? And I'm going to have to bring you down a peg here because I don't know what I'm looking at. I don't know if I'm looking at main character syndrome or like discarded bootleg concept art for Gollum from Lord of the Rings. Seriously, <laughs> what am I looking at? <laughs> that, was, that was really mean. I'm sorry. <laughs> Was that too mean? <laughs> yeah, that was a little bit, that was, that was too mean. I apologize. I'm not really a photogenic person as it is. If you ever capture me posing like this picture, you have free will to honestly just kill me. Just, <laughs> right, that's gonna be it for today's video, guys. If you enjoyed it, be sure to like and subscribe. It really helps me out. Let me know down below what type of videos you wanna see because I'm still easing myself back into YouTube. And with that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys next time.